guys, it's Julia and welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be doing my September TBR talking about the books that I hope to get to in the month of September. I don't usually do TBR videos anymore just because I don't follow them and I find them stressful but I do have some planned reads this month so I thought I would make a video about it and I also just thought I enjoy watching TBR videos so maybe you guys want to see a monthly one I don't know but I wanted to make one this month and hopefully follow it and I'm also participating in the I suck at readathons readathon later this month so I'll probably have a separate TBR going up for that later but without further ado let's get into some of the books that I want to read this month first off we're gonna be talking about the big book in the room the elephant in the room whatever it, um I've been reading this for a while now it feels like it's been a long time honestly it's been since like mid-August or like early August but I'm hoping to finish this before the movie release date which I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it but hopefully I can if not it's okay but I hopefully can read this before the movie comes out and see the movie but I'm about 350 pages in and I'm currently filming this near the end of August so we will see what happens. <laughs> up here I have The Godfather by Mario Puzo. This book I'm going to be buddy reading this month with my friend Rachel and I'm so excited to read this book and basically all I know about it it's just like the mafia. Just all that's all I know. Um, blood, power, legacy, honor. Sounds interesting and I haven't seen the film which is really highly acclaimed and is everywhere. So I'm really excited to read this book. I really don't know what to expect but I kind of like going into it blind so I'm excited to see how I end up enjoying this one and how Rachel ends up enjoying it as well. I bought a lot of manga because I uh, Indigo had a sale for buy one get one 50 so I did end up purchasing a lot of it, uh, a lot of manga, but I'm hoping to read Cheese Sweet Home volume one and it's a little manga about Kitty and I'm so excited for it because I read this author's other work, Fuku Fuku, and it was just so much fun and cute. So I'm hoping just to have like a nice light read at home and it's, colored and it's just a collection and I'm so excited for this and I've been like telling myself Julia like stop reading like you gotta finish it like stop trying to read manga right now <laughs> so I've been holding off on a lot of the manga that I really want to read but I'm so excited for this one and if I really like it then I can read volume two but I'm just putting volume one on this TBR for now. Two books I don't have physically with me at the moment but first up is Sleeping Beauties which is coming out the 26th of September which I'm super excited for personally I don't know what it's about but it's Stephen King's work with his son Owen King so I'm super excited to see what he's gonna bring to the table this time um, I'm not I didn't look at any synopsis per personally because I don't really want to know I just want to go into it really blind and I don't know like because I'm pretty sure it's a big book I'm pretty sure it's like five six hundred pages but um, so I don't know if I'm going to be fin able to finish it in like the four last days of the month. So if I don't, then that's going to be going on to my October TBR, but I'm hoping to get a good chunk of the way through Sleeping Beauties this month. Last but not least, it's a book that's coming out September 5th and it's called Project Semicolon. And this is a YA book that is a collection of essays, I believe, and it just deals with suicide awareness. So I really want to support, obviously, awareness for suicide. So obvious trigger warnings for suicide with this book but I really want to read it and I heard about it and I just am so excited to read it and I think it's gonna be really powerful and meaningful so I'll let you guys know what I think about that one. You guys have it that was my TBR for September I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know down below what you are planning on reading this month. Also if you I don't know if you noticed or if you care but I'm not wearing makeup in this video. There's a youtuber named Sarah Hawkinson who does these no makeup Monday videos so I thought every single Monday I will post a video without wearing makeup or just I'll try to post them more regularly because I know specifically even on booktube I love makeup personally but sometimes I feel like I have to put it on to film which shouldn't be the case but I feel like it is so I'm gonna be trying to film with no makeup so sorry if you're not used to seeing me like this uh, some people say I look the same some people say I look really different but we'll see and if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell to be updated for when I post new videos and all that sort of stuff. And I'll see you all very soon with a new video. Bye! Whatever you do in life will be 
insignificant. But it's very important that you do it. Because nobody else will.